All right, everyone. It is me, Johnson Chan. Uh, not much to do or say today, but uh, you know, um, I don't know, I've been working on my game, getting a little frustrated, but I think I'm accepting that there's just going to be some limitations, you know. So, because at the end of the day, at least the engine that I'm using, um, you know, basically works, right? It's just got a lot of rough edges, but it could be smoothed out. Uh, but it does mean that it's going to change my vision somewhat. But um, I think I'm figuring out there might still be other ways I can get around it. So uh, we'll have to see. Um, but my game is basically going to come out like this. Uh, and because of the limitations, uh, I'm have to try to figure out how I'm going to deal with the PvP system. But I think I'll still have it. I, th I, I think it'll be kind of like Albion Online, where you'll have a lot of safe zones. All right, can I make this bigger? Yeah. Uh, yeah. So you have a lot of safe zones, right? But, um, you know, you have PVP, on, you have, you know, like PVP areas, and that's where you'll get, like, the best stuff. But then the, I'll use the auction house mod. So even if you're a safe player, you'll just use the auction house. Uh, and in my game, I want to try to figure out how to make money and all items available. So basically everything will have craft, it will be, everything will be used for crafting. So that's, how, that's the first way you make everything valuable. And number two, ammunition in this game will be very expensive, right? And everyone's going to be a ranged class because the, because there's something wrong with the melee in this game. It looks so awkward. So I just simply have everybody just be, uh, ranged. So, you know, your character be more defined by, like, the weapons, I guess, they use. But be pretty generic and simple. So, I don't know. I'll have to just work on it. Because, like, I was kind of just debating with myself yesterday. You know what? I Maybe mean, I should just give up. Just go learn poker. Just play my video games. And just leave it like that. And it's like, no, but it's like, eh. So, I want to try to give it another go. But definitely going to try to try take things easy. Also, now I'm trying to ask for help in their Discord channel. Let me, oh, actually, they responded. Let me see. Uh... I say to put a collider. Okay. Uh, oh, okay. If you add your sprite to the tile palette, it'll generate it. You can duplicate the add old. Uh, oh, okay. All right. <sighs> okay. Well, thanks so much, Blinks. <clears throat> I have no idea what the hell's going on in the Discord. I will now try to see if it works. I will say here. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Did you add Archer's basic attack? Okay. Yeah, because there's a problem with the game. Like, I'm trying to give my monsters the ability to attack you from range also and also have projectiles coming out of it. Because the problem is they attack you and you don't see anything. They just look at your directions. You just take damage. You need some kind of player feedback so you know, hey, this guy is trying to kill me kind of thing. It's like, you know, I want to try to get that, you know, to fix itself. So anyway, uh, so at least personally, I'll keep myself busy, you know, because I really don't like the fact that, you know, God gives me all these skills and I wind up not doing anything with it. And I get that everything's meaningless, but, you know, I figure I should try to do something. I don't know. But I can't be hard on myself either, because that's also what Satan would want. So it's like, <laughs> you know, I just, I, I just try to take it a little at a time. And that's how you do it with uh, money making. And then that's actually how you get rich. So... Bitcoin searches are finalizing at 16, it looks like, for this week. Cryptocurrency is still flatlining, uh, essentially, because they're probably waiting on the Monday morning markets. Bitcoin down is at 64.8%. 24-hour bond is very low at 101.5 billion. So right now, nobody's doing anything. Bitcoin's at 61.67. Litecoin's at 38.52. Um... Dogcoin is at two, basically 220 million market cap. Uh, Steam, where's Steam? Uh, is up to 60, position 60 now, 17.45 cents. It's also uh, like 21, 23 cents for high points, which sucks is I bought it at like 30, 31 cents and then it started tanking it to the bottom. So it's already lost one third of its value. <laughs> God damn it. Well, that's how it always works. You gotta just do it long term. Uh, but yeah, I'll definitely be looking to buy more hive power uh, once it gets a little cheaper and you know, crypto gets a little better. Um, <clears throat> let's see. Uh, there doesn't see on task force decision on reopening economy. So this is actually pretty important. This is the fundamentals we wanna look at. 
um, and nothing else here. Uh, JFC coins down a five to six, but it really should be going back up to six to seven. But right now, nobody's buying anything. 404 coins still pretty good, seven to eight, right? So it's, in, it's holding steady. Uh, two by two coin, 58 to 59. The difficulty in, in minting is st starting to finally have an impact on prices, so that's very good. Uh, compound coin remains pretty stable at 63.35 to 8100 Satoshis of a dog coin. So compound coins, you know, really uh, stepping up here, you know. Um, uh, after Fed creates six trillion, uh, yeah, so this is just some, you know, whatever, say, yeah, you know, this is why we need cryptocurrency because of hyperinflation, which is technically true, but it's really not nearly as bad. I don't actually, hyperinflation is not that bad as long as you can control the interest rates. That's why we can flood the world with $6 trillion and nobody gives a shit. Well, I don't give a shit. People who don't know anything, you know, do care or they still subscribe to the end the Fed stuff. Well, if you remove a central bank, you know, you'll see what really will happen. All right? There's a reason why a lot of people back in 1913, even though they were very opposed to a central bank, eventually caved in. All right. So, you know, you know, the other problem is, you know, libertarians especially are very, um, because obviously we all know from the Ron Paul thing, and I used to be a Ron Pauler. You know, they're very anti-Fed. Well, I've noticed that libertarians are like some of the worst fucking people ideologically like that, that can be out there. It's like they completely fuck everybody over. And I'm glad that coronavirus completely ass rapes that fucking ideology. So no one's going to be uh, listening to libertarians af uh, afterwards. Like, I guess if, you know, actually maybe I should shift from attacking liberals, which I don't really do as much, you know, because we kind of already know, to sh shifting our ire towards the fucking libertarians. Uh, so, you know, they're, they're, they're the ones that are, like, fucking everything up. Because, uh, again, as I always say, they, they represent the worst aspects of both the left and the right. So what's the point? And they're very selfish. Very selfish. So it's like, all right, let's just destroy their ideology. Uh, exempted from holy pants license in Singapore until summer. So fine. So Singapore's on top of that. Da, 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 da. Bitcoin halving. Nobody even cares about Bitcoin halving at this point. Uh, Files path for Bitcoin competitor. Uh, unusual crypto. I kind of don't care. If it's centralized and it's by Microsoft, then it's the same thing. So they're trying to create Libra. Uh, I, mean, I normally just read it, but to be honest, I just don't really care. Um, well, okay, I guess but I care now. Um, saying a cryptocurrency is powered by the human body. So basically, it's going to be like the Matrix. That's hilarious. Uh, special sensors that connect to a certain crypto mining participants. A server sent a task for the user device and checked when the, when the user's body activity meets the conditions of the system. Uh, you know what? I guess this will be the um, the thumbnail. Uh, so I'm obviously going to pass. All right, I don't want Microsoft plugging their shit into my fucking body so we can make uh, Microsoft coins. Okay, uh, it's like what, what 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 the hell, man? That's literally what it says. A brainwave or body heat emitted from the user when the user performed tasks provided by information or service provider, such as viewing advertising or certain internet services can be used in the mining process. Um, look, Google already knows all my shit. The last thing I need is Microsoft taking Google's idea and like physically attaching it to my fucking body, all right? You know, the idea of Deus Ex, like those video games, for those who don't play video games, yeah. All right, this is where you know you like you have implants and shit. So this is also actually pretty good. Mankind divided, though I still kind of like the original. The other, I mean, I all of DX, the DSX games are good except Invisible War. That, that's just shit. Uh, I'm trying to get a picture of it. All right, here you're an augmented human with like combat implants and shit. All right, that's kind of like where I also got kind of the idea for like my dream. Uh, TV series and I mentioned I guess now my game, all right? Uh, you know, see, it's not this, all right? Here, you're, you're, it's gonna be like the Matrix, all right? It's just, you'll just be a slave to the system. So uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna pass. But nonetheless, I'm glad they're getting into crypto because obviously the more people that get into crypto, the more mainstream the idea of it get, uh, becomes. 
And as we could see, good old Trump is surpassing Biden. I mean, now Biden's mental capacities are now just, you know, going to start really eating away at him. And they got the sexual harassment um, accusations. And then it'll be, uh, yeah, it'll be over for Biden. Pence says virus ter- task force. Soon. Oh, yeah. The other thing is the the fake news terrorist media has to realize that if Trump goes away, so do, so do they because they have nothing to complain about. Nobody's going to watch them anymore. Right, because there's no more orange man bad. Right, I mean, like after the coronavirus stuff, like, and we got the and um, the stimulus bill passed. You know what I wound up doing on Twitter? Nothing. I just stopped using Twitter. Right, I posted a couple of tweets, and then that's it. I didn't give a shit. <laughs> so that's exactly what's going to happen with fake news terrorists if Trump is gone. So uh, yeah, Ped says virus task force. Uh, to go deliver a recommendation on whether to reopen the economy. Um, okay, and the president will make the decision. Okay, so there's no news on this one. Okay, all right, so Trump's up, Microsoft's going matrix mode, and right now there's nothing to report because we've got to wait on the markets to open. And it's 11 a.m. here in New York City, so. Uh, if you like what you saw, read or heard, hit the like button, the follow button, subscribe button for wherever you're watching this from, or on my YouTubes at youtube.com forward slash uh, JFC Radio. Make sure you smash that subscribe button on the right hand side of this page uh, so we can continue growing this channel, or from wherever you're watching this from. Anyway, I'm honestly done for the day. I want to get going with my day, which isn't much, but I want to you know, keep thinking more about my code and also maybe playing a little more Tarkov or something, or Age of Empires. I've been playing that a lot, too. So, Anyway, enjoy the rest of your day or night. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay away from people. Alright, six feet All right, is the recommendation, and it obviously works. And then uh, hopefully we'll be able to reopen America within a couple weeks or by Easter, but... I don't know, we'll, we'll have to see, because it's so weird. I go out there, it's a fucking ghost town, right? Normally it's supposed to be at, like around a thousand people at any given time walking the streets in my neighborhood, right? Uh, is it a thousand? Yeah, a thousand every like 30 to 60 minutes. Like We're very dense, right? You know, people to people right next to each other. That's how crowded it is here. Then it's a ghost town where I could count, not including myself, 12 people on the streets. That everything's closed down. You would You would think this is the Great Depression, so... Yeah, but anyway, see you all in tomorrow's video. Hopefully there will be some, well, there probably will be action. Um, I think prices should go back up because so far we haven't seen anything different, right? right? We already know cases are going up. Uh, in fact, maybe we might be peaking, at least hopefully here in New York City, uh, but we'll have to see. So, uh, but for now, again, I'm not buying, right? Right now, I'm just doing my normal thing and just waiting this out. So, Judson Chan. JMC coin, a 404 coin, and Microsoft is now coming out with the uh, Microsoft Matrix coin. <laughs> I can't believe they're really doing that, man.